everybody and welcome back to Forever Stranded Lost Souls. So, in this episode, what are we going to do? Well, we've created the grindstone, so we actually need to... Really, what I was trying to do was to make some dust, to make some clay, I think, is the idea. But we've got primal core in this pack, and I didn't know very much about it, but I sort of did some research on it. So there's actually quite a few things it does for us. And all these tools are... We've got all these early tools like flint shears, pickaxe, hatchet, and the shovel are all primal primal core stuff anyway one thing we can do with that is actually make torches we'll have a look at that, how we do that in a second and then we have to make a whip to actually get them which means we have to sieve gravel so let's see how it's uh, you know it's a rabbit hole as they say so now the first thing we're going to do is we need a bit more xp i think i would like to get my xp levels up a bit and i'm going to make a few more if i've got the equipment that is. I'm going to make a few more pickaxes, especially stone pickaxes. I've got enough for two more. Because by the time we finish we use a load of stone pickaxes. Put those back in there like that. And I've got that's a hatch. It's good for trees. I want to have a look outside and see how we're doing with our tree. See if it's actually managed to grow yet. Let's quick look around. Mobs. There's one above me there. Following me. I don't know what it is. Whether it's coming from below or above. Let's go and just check it. That's uh, probably above, huh? Right. Oh, this made me jump. Where has it gone to one? No, I got it. <laughs> well, I knew it was there. I could see it on the map, but I couldn't see where it was. So the tree still hasn't grown. Okay. Now, prior, Psycho Net Nightmare Mangle has told me about this thing, and I thought I hadn't knew what it was. It's basically a way to actually make, to get rid of lava. So let's have a look where we've got some lava in the situation. I think we've got some lava about some up here, for example. Let's get rid of this. What you can do with this thing, it protects me against lava for one thing. So when I walk a blossom, so I'm not getting any damage, which is great. But also, you can pick it up. So you right click it. You've got to get it in the right mode. I think I need to shift right click it to put it into the sort of uh, glowing mode. And then we can pick up lava. Just like that. And there's two blocks of lava here, so we can do the same thing again, and it'll pick it up. Now, when we have a look at this, we should see it's got uh, it's holding two buckets of lava. Fantastic. Um, so what I want to do is I want to get rid of that lava up there. So what we'll we'll do is we'll go and get some more. Um, we'll get some more experience while we're here, actually. If I can, that is, and don't get killed in the process. Some coal here, so let's get some coal. Let's take the. Will you save the iron pickaxe? Zombie pigmen, aren't they? So we don't need to worry about those too much. So I'm going to attack them. Let's get rid of this coal. So that's giving me 7 XP. I'm going to put that 7 XP straight away onto my mining skills because I want to get this mining skills up as much as possible. And here we've got some nether quartz, I think. Let's get this going as well. I think that's all the XP there, isn't it? So that gave me three more. There wasn't very much there. And this one is here. What's this we got up here? Iron ore. Fantastic. Now let's go harvest that. Can I reach it from here? Maybe. If it's telling me I can see it, then I probably can reach it. No, I'm too low. Let's get some more blocks of another rack. I don't want to completely break my chisel while I'm doing my thing. Let's make up, just craft this up into a couple of blocks. And I don't think I need this in my hot bar. So let's just see if we can climb up and get that iron. Because iron's going to be very important in all Minecraft games. Oops. I just. Uh, <laughs> that wasn't very clever. I missed some blocks. Let's get some more. Try that again. Now I should be able to reach this. I can. I can. Now I don't get for this. Oh, I do get XP. Fantastic. What do we get there? Four ingots. Four nuggets, which isn't actually a huge amount, but it's better than nothing. We also got some XP from that. 
which is also good. Uh oh, there's something over there I don't want to see, I think. You can see the magic bubbles. So we shall keep clear of it. I don't know what it is. I think they tend to die. But in here, there's quite an interesting area. So I want to get in there, but I've got to wait for this thing to disappear. Right, oh, I've got some more. I've got some more. Um, another rack, uh, quartz. Up. Let's get this while I'm here. Hopefully there's no lava above my head, but I think it doesn't matter so much with the... Oops. Oh. Yep. <laughs> Another mic got me. <laughs> Again. I will have to get some protection. Right, we're in a... Let's go and get our thing. I've got to die one at once an episode, haven't I, really? So. The trouble is I lost all my XP now, because I... That nether might it was too fast for me. The tomb disappears. Well, we can probably get a revenge on them. Oops. Oops. Nope. nope. I failed to get my revenge on those two. <laughs> we'll do it again in a second. I did have a sword with me, didn't I? Right. There were two nether mites. That was the problem. Unfortunately, they can't see me. The tomb disappears. Let's have a go. Can I get them? Oh, they went down that. <laughs> right. I think I shall uh, give up on those for the time being <laughs> and do something else. If I can get them. It would be nice. I don't think they're a bit nasty, aren't they? There's an Enderman. But I'm invisible. I think I'm invisible also to Enderman. The tomb disappears. How, he how healthy is this thing? It's actually quite healthy, considering. Anyway, what I wanted to do was come over here. Now, I think while I'm here, I can safely break this down here. Let's just break this down. This will break the pickaxe, but I should get through. No, I didn't. Good. What we've got here is some diamond ore. And I need XP to level 12. So I've got... But there's plenty of stuff here around here to get XP level 12. So let's just get this mined up here. Quick look around. See, so we're reasonably safe. For that zombie, zombie pigman over there. Let's get this stuff mined up. Oh. Now my pickaxe is broken, which is a shame, but I want to... Well, I've got a second one, so let's just do this one. So we should be able to go down here and pick up that as well. Now I've got some... What experience have I got? Now I have got uh, seven. What can I do for my mining? Do I need level eight or not? Let's have a look. No, I need level seven. Okay, I need seven, right. There's some more, another quartz up here. Let's get this one while we're at it. Now we've got our seven. Let's go up a level then. I can hear that nether mite. Which, of course, has just got me twice. Anyway, I haven't got so much XP now, so it's not so important. But if we look over here, we get quite an interesting area. We've got some redstone ore. But it's probably worthwhile getting that gravel as well while I'm here. Oops. Go away, you. You're going to... Gonna Keep attacking me until I get it. Oops. Oh. Oh. These nether mites are a pain. <laughs> Very much a pain. Right. Here we go again. I should get rid of some of my death points as well because I'm going to get confused as to <laughs> where I am. Try and 
trouble is I can't kill it because if I do try to kill it, it will I will not be invisible anymore. The tomb disappears. Oh, he's only got one and a half heart. We can probably risk it now. Got revenge on Nethermit. Yes, thank you. I did get revenge eventually. Let's pick up this. Now, if I do this with a shovel, which he gets it all in blocks, so that's actually quite nice as well. No appetite. Good. Now, this is cobalt ore. Can't do much with that for the time being. And redstone, I think we need level 10 for. Let's have a look. Oh no, I can get the redstone. Okay, let's get some redstone. Because that's quite good as well, because that gives us experience. Not too much that time, because there wasn't too much there, but it gives you experience. Let me get rid of these death points. And I've got to figure out, I still haven't figured out how to turn that off. I did turn it off the other day when I was playing, and I didn't remember what keystroke I used. In fact, Within that, I can also walk through the fire as well. With that chalice, that's really good, that chalice. Now, down here is an interesting area. Let's go and have explore it. First of all, can we get down to this area? There's also a fortress here, look. Oh, that's of coal. Let's go and get this coal, because we can do the... Let's stand on top. And mine the coal. See if we can get another layer of a level of XP. Something shooting at me. Something fell down and died. So if we must be a blaze. I can't see him, which is good. So he's not going to get me, is he? So let's get this as well. I've got seven XP now, so let's just do this one. That's why you need a lot of pickaxes. Okay, no nether mites that time. That's good also. Let's, um, now I should be able to upgrade my XP again now with level 9. Mining, let's get this up again. So then we're nearly reaching the level 10, which is where I'm wanting to get to. Because we can't obviously break this, because we need 15 for the, that flame mite toy. Now let's have a look. Is there a way down here? There might be a way down at the top here. Oh, this I can see the blaze up there now. And he's still shooting at me. I'm missing, fortunately. Right. There might be a way down if I mine my way down here, but I probably need to go back now and get some more. Let's have a look down here. What have we got down here? Some glowstone ore, which is always good. Glowstone, I mean. And I don't see any other minerals in here at the moment, which are worth mining. Can we get out of here? We might be able to. Let's just have a go around through here. Can't be, can't be very far. And not some iron ore, which is fantastic. Let's get that as well while we're here. What did I get that time? 36, that's four ingots. That's actually that's pretty good because we need we're gonna need we're gonna need iron, whatever else we do. As I said, now we should be able to come out here. Back to where we were. Actually I'm not going the right direction for base, am I? Well That's where we came in, so let's come out over here. Because that's a diamond door, and we can't break the diamond door until we go oh, level 12. So I need a little bit further to go to to get that. And down here, there's this again. Now I can hear that nether mite again, can't I? Oops. Indeed, I can. <laughs> let's get away from that as fast as we can. Now, I have been killed by nether mites more than enough today. Let's have a look, how's my tree doing? It's still not grown. This is actually a bit of a nuisance. I'll tell you what we can do. 
Let's craft up this netherrack here and let's build a little tower and go up up and then get rid of the the lava from up here. And then that might help the trees to grow. And I think it's just one block, so let's just pile up from here. Can I reach the top of that yet? No, not quite. Now I can. I think it's just one source block up here. Let's go. Yep. Can we reach that source block from here? That's in its right mode. That's good. Yes. Oops. No, I just do. I didn't pick it up. I just broke it, didn't I? Good. Same thing, really, I suppose. And that's our diet ore, which we can't use at the moment. What else is through here? Let's have a look. Bit of exploring today. I'm still getting slain by another night's too much well there's some ore, more ores over there that might be worth doing I'll tell you what we're going to do now we're going to go back to base and see if we can um, can I get down here easily or do I have to break my power my turm as it were my tower of climbing I think that's probably about the best route isn't it Yes. So now we've got rid of the lava anyway. Let's break this down here. When I get low enough, I'll jump. Like that. Okay, right. Now it's time to do some crafting, I think. There's a zombie pigmen around. But it's nice not having to worry about lava at the moment. I've got recipes in here. Share recipes for grindstone. Yes, we can see the recipes in here. 13 pages of them. Blaze powders, sugars, things we can't get yet. This is the next one we're going to have to do, I reckon. Different dyes. Mostly dyes, okay. And then we get the flour, which we need, I think. There's various recipes, and it's green, yes, okay. Okay, good. That was the one I just saw there. The last one there. Well, the last one was the recipe that I was actually looking for. Clay from dirt. So you can grind... Okay, we can use dirt in here and it'll give us clay. That's fine. So now we need to... Let's have a look at the recipes. We've got um, things we need to do. So we've got as much XP as we, we want, we can do so far. I should really have a look at these as well. We've got bonsai. And actually, that would be quite a good recipe but I think for that one we need the problem with this one is I need clay that's why I was starting to do clay tables we can do better with mods well actually we've already done this one can I actually break this and put it back so that I can break it that's no problem will it detect the quest or do I have to make a new one oops No, nope, it's not detecting, I don't think. Oh, that's a shame. I made it too early, didn't I? Uh, in fact, I could make another millstone. That's probably a good idea, because it's got some good rewards and that. So what all that was was a bit of um, a sticks, wasn't it? We needed some gears, which I've got not enough sticks for. I've got enough wood, but not enough sticks. Okay. So that's why I'm waiting for the other thing to come through, and they actually fixed up, fixed up. That's why I'm waiting for the, the trees to grow. I could do these. It's actually a bit slow. I don't ask me why that's so slow. Put those back in a chest where we've got some chests with iron in it. We could put the glow stick. Let's have a look at what we've got uses for that one. It should be able to tell me. Oh, it doesn't have any restrictions. I think I should be able to break that as well. Yes, I can break it. It says pickaxe diamond on the top there, but I'm just using a stone pickaxe. Oh, it's not rubbish. I'm, 
doing that wrong. It says pickaxe diamond, but I should be able to use an iron pickaxe for me. Yes. So we can collect gold as well. We can't get um, diamond yet because we need a higher level for that. In fact, I should smelt this. Well, well oh, I won't smelt it just yet. We've got plenty of time to smelt that, haven't we? Might even do that off camera. Right, put that stuff up there. I've got some more of this. Got some redstone at last. What I should also do is make some chests, shouldn't I? Let's do that because the chests aren't actually that expensive. Let's make a couple of chests. I think that's all I have to do for that. I say aren't that expensive. We used all my wood up. Anyway, I could put these just down here like this. And probably like this. Then take out everything out of here. And put everything we've got in there, I think would be a good start. There's what is the need from that, probably that one. So I would like to break I should break this would be the easiest way, wouldn't it? And then I can just simply put everything I've got in there straight away. So what else do we want? I want a millstone. My iron picks and the rest of it. Well, we've got some five, five trees. Let's go and plant those because they're going to help. At least with sticks. I don't know. I've planted a whole load of them. Just have a quick look around here. Are we safe at the moment? Yes, we are. Plant those. I'll plant those over here. I'll break this one first of all. That's an axe for that, isn't it? It always bothers me the noise that thing makes. And I just we're hoping that this tree gets growing faster, because this is basically is a it's a, a critical com part of the the game. This, and I think it's supposed to be able to twerk, but oh, it does work. That never. <laughs> Well, do you know that didn't work before when I was did it when I was doing the development versions. I didn't think it worked. So there we are. I'll be wasting load of time on that. Let's get rid of this. Oops. Let's also get this working the fast way. Break the crook and make another one. And I got a big tree, which is sort of excellent. Oh, we've got 13 saplings too, which is also excellent because that means I can start to plant some more saplings down and make some dirt. Oh, that's really good because that's opened up the game a lot now. So let's get on with this then. I've also got some worms. That's also worms. I've also need to make a crook. Have I got enough sticks for crook? I didn't get any sticks from breaking those leaves. Oh, okay. That's going to be a bit of a nuisance. But I've got enough saplings to deal with that, so maybe I don't care. But no sticks, that's a bit of a sh bit of a problem. Right, what I'll do is I'll take the... Oh, I probably need another axe as well. Flint hatch, it's going to break when I do this tree. <laughs> as I said, but this time I did get some sticks, which is also good. Right, let's go and make another crook. I don't know how many sticks I've got, so have a look. 21, fantastic. So I can make a crook, I can make a compressed crook. I think that's also a quest we've got coming. Let's open up at the moment. So let's make some of those. I can make five, so I'll take one of those away. And make four crooks, because that's going to give us another reward. Then we're going to make, uh, what are we going to make? Some uh, stone axes, I think. Of course, that's going to drop those on the floor, isn't it? Because I've used the wrong table. Stone axes, I'll use some. Let's make them out of cobblestone. Make one axe, one pick. Let's have a check the quest now. Okay, this is the one. 
so we can make a compressed crook so let's make a compressed crook that's basically it's just a crook form of crooks we get a cross so that will complete that reward so we can actually open up that one let's have a look again what we're going to do is item reward so we get everything we also get a second compressed crook done and then that opens up sieving which is great and also barrels so let's think next i'm going to make us a sieve but first of all we're going to finish off cutting down that tree i might open up the, uh, the chest first of all so that we get chameleon storage rare and that's something else i don't know what it does <laughs> never mind i'll put that away in fact that's not really the right place for this and i'll put away the chance cube we'll put everything in here for the time being and i'll sort it out later on when i'm between episodes I was saying I tried I tried twerking before but it didn't work in the earlier versions but there's plenty of saplings that's good so let's see if we can break the rest of this now with this Some more that's great have I dropped any so what what happens is when you've done this you, you lose your block but doesn't matter we'll put another one down here we'll let that do its stuff while we go and uh, inside and actually make some more bits and pieces which are important for this game like for example a barrel and a sieve so we should have plenty of wood now 13 I only got okay never mind it'll be enough for what we need so let's get this done I think I'm going to do half to the top 24 pieces of wood so we're going to make some of slabs of course so that and I think I need to look at the sieve recipe that's this one so we're missing a stick there must be some more sticks around because I've made a load of them Oops. Didn't I have to, oh, I guess I used them all up, didn't I? Now that was smart. <laughs> and what's around here? I can hear him hissing away. Blaze, I don't want to get near Blaze if it's possible. Tell you what we'll do, we're going to twerk over these trees over here. I just fall too far. So just pressing shift, does it work on these trees? I hope it doesn't work on the nether trees. Let's go back. Oh, the one of them's grown already, that's great. So maybe I can get some. Oh. Yes, I can see you, and I can see you too. Now the mag magmas are actually quite good to, to grind because they give you armour. So let's just get rid of this stuff first of all. And I can see that that's uh, giving me the sticks I wanted, which is great. And I can see that can plays juggernaut as well. So I should be able to use this axe on this tree now. So it's quite a long time to use that axe. So with a bit of luck, if I get if I can get rid of that juggernaut, let's have a look, what can I do for getting rid of the juggernaut? This is coming towards me, isn't he? You can actually trap him in. But I don't want to get killed in order to do that. If it's possible, that is. Oh, there's, did I not get some? No. So I've got seven of these now. Yes, I can hear him squidging away, and I would like to get him, but I don't want to get killed by the juggernaut. No. There he is, look. Oops. Right, just I just survived that one. Which is lucky. <laughs> just let's get some food out of here. Um I'm gonna keep those. Oh, I've got a bug on me, haven't I? Doesn't matter about that. I'll go dark. Oh no, I didn't go dark that time. 
What else have I got to eat? I've got some equestrian spores. We'll eat those. And I've got another wood termite in there. That'll do. That'll do. Yes, that's got to give me blindness. What else can we eat? I've got to wait for him to go. I can't do anything because he's going to kill me. I don't want to get anywhere near him, really. Unless I can block him in. Then we can kill him. Right. Okay. So I'm in the process of making this, aren't I? So I should be able to do that now. Make a sieve good. And I've got wood sieve finished. What's going on here? <laughs> That's the... Uh, have I planted that spore down here? I have, haven't I? That's a bit of a nuisance, actually. You have to break the block to get it out. That's no big deal. can break the block. So now, we've got that quest completed. And the next one to do was string. So I'm going to have to plant some more stuff. But what we can do is make a barrel. And that's another quest, I think. Let's just check it. Done that one. Choice reward. I'll take the loot chest, I think. And then we can do barrel. We've got to make four wooden barrels. Okay, that's no, I think that shouldn't be a big deal. Let's do that. So we've got four slabs, so we just need, right. I need, uh, I need more wood than that. Get those two out of there, and then let's make some more wood. Where do they go to in here? Huh? Oh, I've got plenty of wood. Let's do this as well. I'm going to use all the wood up like this. If I need. If I need other wood, then I've, I've got a problem, so that's... And the last one. So there we are. Now we should have completed that quest. Barrels are fun. Fantastic. And what we're going to do is put down one of these barrels straight away. I'll actually open the loot chest first of all. Ah, oh, some storage upgrades. Uncommon. I'm going to make some dirt. I should be able to make two blocks of dirt with this lot. It's eight. It's eight per. So I'm going to make two blocks of dirt. So I'm going to get the second one down here. Like that. Now has he gone away? Is that juggernaut? I think the juggernaut might have disappeared. should be great because I want to have a go at getting this magma uh oh he's over there look he's got his magic there's two of them over there and they're looking at me I have to be careful though see if I can get rid of this juggernaut um, there he is well, I got it that time but he can't jump up which is great and I can't reach him which is actually not great Throw me up. Oops. Haha. <laughs> I was a blazing juggernaut again. So he did sneak up on get me from behind. Nice. Well, by the looks of it, I'm gonna just go and get my my coffin again. Let's see if that juggernaut's disappeared. No, no he hasn't. What I can do with the Juggernaut, though, is to put him in a case. So let's do that. Because I've got two minutes now where I can actually do something with this guy. So let's put some blocks down, see if we can encase him. Can I push him out of the way? Yes, I can. Good. So if I put a block here, oh, I'm getting pushed about. I need, I need this amount, don't I? If I can just case him in like this, 
He can't get to me. Ha, <laughs> he's moved. And he moved again. Oh well, never mind. Oh, there's two of them over there. That's not good. How much time have I got left? And another one over there. I better get out of the way. <laughs> what I want to do is plant these trees, don't I? Let's go and, let's go and do that. How much time have I got left on my death counter? I think it's already expired. Oh, 42 seconds. Right, we'll use the 42 seconds. And we'll just quickly plant some trees down here. Here's one plate. Oops, wrong one. Pick that with an axe. I'll have to be more careful than this, won't I? Put that down there. And then put the tree into here like that. And we'll go and do another one over here somewhere. Yep, my time's run out. I'm getting attacked again. <laughs> oh, okay. That's not good. <laughs> I left it too long. Right. Tell you what. I think that's enough for this episode. As you can see, I'm well and truly a ghost. I'll see you next time. Bye for now.